Hey everyone, it's Rad, and I want to thank Keen for they are the sponsor of this video. And don't skip ahead, for I do have a special and exciting announcement to uh, make, including a very, very special gift for anyone who is watching, which I will get to it a uh, soon. For those who doesn't know Keen, this amazing website provides you with an access to a vetted psychics, spiritual advisors who can provide a guidance and insight in into life's challenges, into clarity in love, into relationships, and as well into career and, and many, many more. And Keen, it is a one of the most uh, affordable way to get an instant psychic reading with a professional at any time, 24 seven. What I love about Keen is that it is perfect for anyone who wants to talk with someone right away, anytime, anywhere there is no wait and it is excellent if you do have a burning question that literally needs an answer right now and it is double perfect for if you are on a budget too and here is where my gift for you guys is coming in for anybody who wants to talk with advisor on keen just click my link in the description down below and you get a 10 minutes for just only two dollars and just see for yourself for i do support keen and i have been around the block a lot when it comes to um psychics readers and especially prophets and i can tell you that there are those who are false but uh judging by the way keen found me i can tell you that they are venting their uh advisors uh, very carefully and you i do encourage you to try it out especially if you do have questions that i cannot answer like for example about health like for example about a reallocation because tarot is just not designed for that uh, for example as well yes or no questions as well guys it's only two dollars for 10 minutes and i cannot think of a better way to try it out and uh, get the clarity you seek so there are a uh, tarot readers, psychic readers, uh, love and relationship advisors, and as well spiritual advisors there. Uh, and you can take your time to make a selection of the reader of your choice, establish a bond, which is going to establish as well a goal, be it a uh, intention setting, be it a, a chakra clearing, be it healing, manifesting, and many, many more. And what is also amazing there is that Keen provides every customer of theirs with a monthly discount, which is a um, clearly a way to show you that they do appreciate you being there and it also provides you with a way to afford multiple readings should you need so the signing up process very simple i'm gonna show you how all that you have to do is just watch my screen very few simple clicks for their website it is made intuitively and it's just you cannot get it wrong and just in these few simple clicks you are get yourself ready to make your selection of uh, readers and dive into your spiritual journey right away so to use my gift just click in the link in the description box and get your 10 minutes with a keen advisor of your choosing for just only two us dollars and and see for yourself how amazing they really are with the variety of their uh, advisors and as well the prices which have a ton of variety too should you be on a budget thank you keen for sponsoring this video all right, Virgo, so this is going to be your uh, monthly tarot reading. And uh, if you do enjoy uh, the content on the channel and uh, you do wish to support us, just leave a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of our uploads, other videos, and as well uh, live streams. Where, by the way, uh, any of you guys can get a free reading from me and uh, with that said let me just finish the shuffle here uh, do the cut and uh, see what kind of a month you are gonna have or go month of april all right first one that will be uh, the ace of uh, wands here followed by the second card which happens uh, to be the hermit uh, moving next we do have uh, the devil and uh, the final one oh my god that is going to be the sun <laughs> actually uh the hermit i was uh, quite displeased looking at the card falling here because the hermit is not a good card falling into that second position of the spread but it, 
uh, for you it works for you uh, it, it works to your benefit so i guess that this is going to be a month where uh if i have to say it like that it's, it's going to be a month where you cannot get it wrong it's literally you cannot get it wrong uh, but the additional cards to the ace of wands we do have the three of wands to the hermit the card is going to be the eight of swords like that to the devil uh the card will be uh the queen of uh wands like that and to the sun the card is going to be the four of pentacles all right so it does look like that this will have more of a business incentive than a romantic incentive it's just we don't have any uh, emotional card here in this month uh, which uh, if we're talking about romantic incentive and especially for you who does have families and so on uh, you can expect that uh, things in your family are gonna go just fine uh, very very well as we don't have any emotional card it means that you are not gonna struggle you're not gonna struggle emotionally <clears throat> So uh, the topic of the month here, the big thing, these two, well, the topic speaks about a huge enterprise coming your way. It's going to be very, very gaining for one. OK, if I have to speculate, if I have to give my uh, <clears throat> my guess what that enterprise is going to be. In fact, I can use the Norman cards to tell you that, but I'm not using this into my tarot readings. So <clears throat> I do think that this is going to be either a job offer or a huge uh, personal project that comes your way uh, with uh, with these two cards and uh, that way uh, this uh, this enterprise like i said is going to be extremely gaining for it it's just you can gain from it a great deal of things not just only money all right not just only money you can gain qualification uh, a cv input as well where you can put it into your cv for your future application it is just is going to be something that stands out in front of anything else uh the the beautiful thing about this job it is jo not just only going to provide you with a future or with this project not just only going to provide you with the future but also is going to be a result of something you deserve okay you worked for that for, for to reach that point and finally comes your way um <clears throat> that could be for example if you are studying astrology and these cards could speak that finally you are ready enough you know to dive and make that astrology into a business and these cards speaks that that business is going to be very very gainingful for you not just only the money that you are going to gain but the connection you know the the satisfaction from from helping people and so on and so forth uh, also this enterprise is going is going to appear as a challenge but not challenge in a bad way not like a challenge you struggle about something this is going to be a challenge where you improve you overcome challenges how can i put it into words not difficult but rather complex situations so you can become better so you can become more qualified so you can become more experienced and so on and so forth and that challenge this this challenging state will allow you to uh, uncover uh, how can i put it into words slumber talents in generally things you are are good at in doing but you had no idea about them it is because you never needed them all right into your current job or into your current business you just did the same thing over and over again it's just rep repetitive experience but now this new experience is gonna uh, is gonna push you into do stuff that you are you have the knack of them but you are, doesn't don't have the experience of them all right and you are where you are going to build up that experience a very very quickly now why uh, these cards usually would have uh, worked toward your disadvantage but actually right now they are very advantage uh, advantageable if that's a word <clears throat> Well, it is because in the normal conditions, these two cards would have mean that that enterprise and that opportunity is not something important, right? It's not going to have a huge impact on your life. However, the day savior here, it is the sun at the end, okay? The sun with the four of pentacles. <clears throat> so then what kind of a tra uh, translation the sun brings to the to the hermit it is that you cannot get things wrong it is just whatever action you make is not going to be uh, definitive enough 
or substantial, so to speak, enough to the enterprise that you cannot re retrace it. You cannot get it, uh, get your or, or take your word back or your action back and try it in a new way, which is going to be way, way, way more efficient. In fact, having the Eight of Swords here is the real kicker because through the through the energies of these two cards to the negative energies of these two cards, because the energy is going to be negative, you know, uh, in a sense of the two you make an action and through that energy this action is not going to feel like you did enough right like you gave enough but in the same time because you haven't gave enough and you haven't did enough you can always fix it you can always get back you know and approach the situation from another angle or well, you you can always date again with a person if the first date was not uh, did, did not suffice enough all right or you can always approach the client if your first approach did not want the client and so on and so forth uh, but with the eight of swords here <clears throat> having it into the uh, as a catalyst to the uh, to the hermit it speaks that this will allow you to unfold and i mean unfold really unfold in fact through that energy which by definition is not negative but unpleasant let's call it unpleasant that definition virgo uh, through this unpleasant energy you will actually gonna realize what truly you are capable of uh, to establish as a business contract you know as in opportunities to grow in general right and you will realize that uh, in fact i think you are underselling yourself by that moment right you are underselling yourself with which uh, I don't want to say with your friends, but with the position you are taking into your social environment, right, or into your love life, and primarily into your career. I mean, you can go for so much more, uh, and that is what you are going to do here by the end of the month. And this realization here that you are underselling yourself by seeing how gaining for that enterprise is and it, it was something not just only unthinkable but unfathomable for you to have but alas you do have it you will realize how huge knack you have for it with what helps you the devil and the queen of wands now i want to talk a little bit about the devil card here uh, because i see readers interpreting this card as uh, aside from interpreting it sexually you know some of them are interpreting it very negatively okay like the devil possess you and and so on and so forth well the devil is actually a very neutral energy energy uh, set aside <clears throat> this energy in fact gives you everything you have ever wanted with a premise for you to misuse it but you do have the choice how to use it and therefore you can not misuse it in fact because we do have the queen of wands here whenever this power because that's a power this opportunity here this gaining for enterprise is going to give you power so this power you are going to have a very big knack how to use that power to the great of not just only your benefit but also to the benefit of others that is because the queen of wands it is one of the two court cards which has a profound understanding into human nature unlike the other core card the queen of wands understands what people need and where the people strength and weaknesses are and therefore uh, working out with this power with this new gaining for enterprise you will give to those that matters around you what they need and therefore amplify their strengths while diminishing their weaknesses another thing about these cards especially if you are single it is that that is a month where you put your best clothes you put your best makeup you know you you basically present yourself to the best you can and you are just going to attract right there just people will want to be a part of your life whether for friends or whether for lovers it just is going to be there you are going to be irresistible but that is only once again if you do uh put some how can i how can i put it into words a best efforts that you do look like that way if it was the other way around the queen was first that would have been given but here it's just you have to make some efforts in order to look like that way but with these cards for the business guys because that's the primary incentive here it seems that you are bound to have a very 
how, how can I put it into words, prevailing, let's call it that way, very prevailing business actions, business maneuvers, deals, and so on and so forth, that are literally going to put you on the map. And the result of all that is going to be the sun with... Uh, with the four of uh, with the four of pentacles and so with these two cards it is just what they promise you it is a undefined a situation of growth or expanding energies of growth so to speak which are undefined uh, based on how far you want to reach okay and based on how far you want to grow uh, you you can grow just as far also these cards are here uh, they are a testament that you are on the right track because the sun only follows its natural uh, natural path it, it rises from the west it, it sunsets or it sets on the towards the it rises on the east i'm sorry it sets on the west and that is how it works that's its natural path and it is just it says that you know what you are going to be involved into this gaining for enterprise it's your natural pinnacle of of development of growth whether in love or whether in career and um the fact that it is neutral to the four of pentacles it means that it is not something set in stone you can grow it for as far as you want to for as much as you feel uh, happy of it Okay, because too much growth, it's it's because overgrowth, it, it's not a good thing either. And so, what you can expect? Well, with that card, you can expect very lucrative business propositions. You can expect very lucrative, very monetary, abundant. Okay, a a business maneuvers that you are to set. And in terms of uh, personal life and personal relationships, this card here, these two cards here, speaks that you are just going to be happy. I mean, people are going to contribute for your happiness but you also need to contribute for their happiness as well and uh, you can as well expect to bury down the hatchets of war with somebody per, for example person in your family co-worker friend or maybe a, a lover as well it's a great month for you virgo it is just don't miss on this enterprise you 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 can't right it's just by these cards you can't but still how important you're going to make it in your life depends on you because we do have the hierophant here uh the hermit i'm sorry here so with that said that was your monthly reading hopefully you do enjoy it and you do liked it and uh, we are to see each other next time until then bye